Hi right, guys, how are you? Mind this one, Titanium. Welcome back to uh, Real Macroeconomics and Investing, patreon.com slash real macro. If you guys really want to understand real macroeconomics and how to apply that into the markets, into investing, come down to patreon.com slash real macro. All right, let's have some fun. More fun from Mousy Boy. <laughs> He keeps giving me fucking material. He's so good at it. July 16th. 33 likes. A super bullish cocktail may hit soon. Yay. Things are wonderful. August 3rd. How many times have we seen this setup? <laughs> Market's going higher. Da 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 da. August 13th, bank credit rising at the fastest pace in 30 months. Everything is fucking beautiful. We are pumping money into the economy. Let's see what happens now. <laughs> oh, market sell-off warning. Blow off top. Now we have a new one. We have a market sell-off warning. Wasn't he just fucking bullish? Wasn't there just a cocktail of fucking bullishness coming? You cannot make this fucking shit up. Not possible. The guy is full of fucking shit. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He thinks he's going to throw some computers back there with some uh, stupid shit. And what? He's going to convince people that he's the fucking man. He knows. But you know what? He keeps getting those little likes, even though he's fucking always wrong. Switches his fucking mind like it's, you know, one day it's like this, the next day it's like that, the next day it's like this, and then this, and then stories about how bank reserves are building up, and now that the debt ceiling is lifted, oh, 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 oh we're going to be rich. Market is going to much, much higher. <laughs> These people are clowns. I'm telling you, they're clowns. All right. going to show you something here. Okay. I shouldn't show it to you, but I will. Only because I'm just mean. Ooh, what does that say? What does that say right there? Oh my god, I almost say $10,000. Now he's coming to tell you there's a warning? <laughs> ah, you guys are never going to learn. You're never going to learn. You're thick at it. You're thick-headed, you're idealistic, you're political, you're uh, not getting it. So it's okay, lose your money. But um, for those of you who do want to come here and you ask me these questions, how long is it going to take me to learn? Uh, I want to use my real money, and I say no. Use your practice account until you're good enough, okay? Um, you know, but can I use a little bit of my money? No. <laughs> So let me talk about this a little bit. <clears throat> Forget about the mousy boy stuff. He's done. He's a fucking idiot. The guy doesn't know what he's talking about. Okay, Mosler doesn't know what he's talking about. He's in outer space. MMT is in outer space. Um, Schiff. <laughs> I told you about Schiff, right? Ten years ago, the guy was a clown. Well, now you guys figured it out. All right, so here's the deal. <clears throat> Number one. People who tell you <clears throat> it's not the same thing um, to use a practice account versus uh, use your own money, real money changes. Okay, they're lying to you. Okay, they're lying. They want your money. They know that you're a scrub. You don't know what the hell you're doing. And as long as you put the money in the market, they can take it from you. Okay, that's plain and simple. That's the way it is. Okay. The other point is, if they get you to use your money, you start getting that addictiveness. Because what they're going to do afterwards is they're, they're going to fucking string you along. Okay, oh, you fucked that up. Oh, you didn't buy when I bought. You didn't sell when I sold. Oh, you know, you went too big. Oh, you went too little. Oh, you went this. Oh, you went that. And then you're always going to feel like the idiot, right? And... When something is going against you, you're going to be stressing out, you're going to be fucked up, you're going to be like, fuck, fuck, what's going on? Oh, shit, uh, should I buy? Should I? With a practice account, you don't get that feeling, right? Okay. You should never have that feeling of what the fuck is going on. Never. Never. If you know what you're doing, 
you'll never have that fucking feeling. Okay? So, when you are telling me I have some money to lose, I have, this is money to lose. There is no such thing as I have money to lose. If you have money to lose, give it to me. Just, I'll give you my PayPal account. Send me your fucking money. The outcome will be the same. I'll even fucking fly over if it's enough. I'll fly over to your house and I'll kick you in your fucking balls. You'll get the same fucking, you know, result. Don't tell me you have money to, to, to lose. Nobody has money to lose. You worked hard for that money. Keep that fucking shit in your pocket. Go out, get a practice account, sit down, start learning how to do things right. And when you get good and consistent with it, and you know what the hell you're doing, and when things are not going your way, you say, oop, I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'm out. See you. And you don't give a fuck. Okay? Because it's not doing what you're supposed to be doing. And you never stress out. Then you can go and put your money in the market. Okay? How about that? Two. Two. Practice is not like the real thing. Really? Then what the fuck was Michael Jordan doing all this fucking... He's an idiot. Michael Jordan is a fucking moron. Tyson even stupider. Why the hell did they go out and practice? Free throw, free throw, free throw. I mean, come on. It's not like the real game. Right? It's not like the real game. Come on. If you want to be good, you have to only practice during games. Like, does that make sense to you? Seriously. You guys want to take a thousand dollars, okay? Whatever it is, five thousand. I don't know what it is to you, little money, small account, whatever. You want to take five thousand, thousand, two thousand, whatever, okay? You want to go up against the very best on the fucking planet, with no macroeconomic understanding, no charting whatsoever, and you want to go and make money. Does that sound fucking right to you? Like, are you crazy? You want to go, what, you want to go pay $5,000 to go beat fucking Mike Tyson? You think you think that's possible? And don't practice? Don't practice. Just fucking sit on the couch, watch TV, make guesses, and you're going to go beat Mike Tyson without a practice. Because you have money to lose. Like, you don't understand what you are talking about. So, please, 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 don't tell me crazy shit, okay? Don't tell me crazy shit. I don't want to hear it. I don't even give a shit if you have a hundred thousand dollars, million dollars. Don't tell me. If you got a million dollars to lose, just give it to me, okay? Just give it to me. Can't make I, I can't make it like think logically. I can't. Either you understand what I'm telling you, or you don't understand what I'm telling you. All right? You want me to teach you? I don't know. Week, month, three months. I don't know what your expectations are. But you want me to teach you a bull market, a sideways market, and a bear market, and whatever time frame you have in your mind. That is not possible i cannot show you what is not there okay uh, it's not possible if you sit down and you are serious and i mean serious about learning and you know it's going to take time just like anything else nobody became a professional basketball player or soccer player or rock star without practicing uh, just because they got a couple thousand, they can lose, okay? And uh, okay, just uh, you know, just tell me what what, I got, what what I gotta do, what I gotta do, coach. Come on, just tell me, you know. That doesn't work that way. You have to see it all. You have to see a bull market, a bear market, and a sideways market. The rules are always different, okay? Based on whatever market you're in. Um, Understanding real macroeconomics instead of your social social media bullshit. That takes time. 
maybe that you can learn fairly quickly okay but just because you understand how uh, macroeconomics works it doesn't mean that you can apply it to investing you have to understand how to contrast that with price action you have to understand how waves move you have to understand how to decipher bullshit okay it's not that simple I am sorry it's not that simple it's not my fucking fault it's just the way the fucking thing is you understand if you want to go and you know see some guy with some fucking yachts and Ferraris and he's rich and he's gonna give you a nice PowerPoint presentations and after the fact kind of charts oh look at this chart see how this perfectly works yeah see that's wonderful and that's what you're looking for and it's never gonna work if you think you're gonna go buy a bot it's not gonna work I'm telling you it doesn't work that way oh Nick you're arrogant you think your way is the only way no I don't I'm sure there's another fucking way to do it uh, probably ten times better than my way go find them please go and find them and when you find them let me know because <laughs> I want to learn too okay but until you get to that find that guy's gonna you know spend whatever three months and you'll give him ten thousand dollars and it's actually gonna work and he's going to teach you bull bear and uh, sideways market and charting and all that wonderful things in three months without the market being bullish sideways or bearish fuck let me know if you think Mike Norman is going to teach you or tell you what's going to happen okay with their little models we're going to build the model we're going to build an economic model you're going to take fucking one trillion fucking pieces of data and you're going to put them all together and then you're going to pump out some fucking model that's going to work you really believe that if you do please by all means go give it to the fed go give it to treasury <laughs> the world needs something like that it doesn't exist okay it just doesn't nobody has a model nobody can synthesize the fiscal flows and tell you what's going to happen i just showed you this clown one day there's a cocktail of fucking bullishness coming the next day fucking we've seen this before and the next day oh yeah there's a market sell-off oh now you figured out there's a fucking market sell-off where were you the fuck were you a fucking month ago <laughs> your social media friends are not gonna make you fucking money clowns on fucking tv personalities are not gonna make you money guys that have been on wall street doing fucking youtube videos are not gonna fucking make you money bullshit economic theories of MMT and you know fucking their debt is our savings is not gonna make you money none of that shit is gonna make you money I promise you you're wasting your time a guy on a Gulfstream 550 or 650 and uh, you know some fucking yacht off the whatever the fuck with his Ferrari he's not gonna make you money some guy who's telling you, I make thousands and thousands of dollars. I do this and I do that. And they're not going to make you money. I had a clown come over. Well, how do we know it's your money? How do we know it's your It doesn't matter if it's my money or not. It's, unless you're going to go out and buy a fucking Ferrari with my money. Okay. Or you gave me your money and I'm not showing you my statements. Then you can complain. Okay. If you think that it's, it's a simulator, it's not a simulator. It doesn't matter. You know, you know why it doesn't matter? Because I want you to bet against me. Go and bet against me. I do it. Go and do it. Tell me how fucking that works out for you. When you blow out your fucking account betting against me, okay, then you're going to figure out it doesn't matter if it's a simulator or not a simulator. All right? So you're going you're gonna to have to come with a whole lot of more bullshit to fucking try to you know change my calls you're not going to change my calls my calls are my calls all right and you see it right in front of you right now i don't know how shit you think i don't have fucking bad trades i fucking have bad trades my man okay and i also have good trades fortunately for me my good trades are better than my bad trades because i don't guess okay i've been doing this too long so you want to go guess? You want to bet against me? You want to tell me you need to see me later? You want to go use your own money? Please, please go do it. 
Go do it the way the books tell you. Go get some fucking RSIs and go get some, you know, oh, you know, government debt equals our savings. And, you know, as long as we keep pumping and the Fed has uh, no wheels left or whatever, you know, he's just a child and don't listen to the Fed and we need socialism and, you know, crash is coming every day. Go, go listen to these people. Please don't come here and tell me, uh, how long is this going to take me? Uh, I got to do a... I got a lunch date. Uh, how long is this going to take for me to learn uh, how to trade? Don't do that. I'm telling you, not here. You're not serious. So that's it for my little video. Uh, bet against me, please. <laughs> do it. Do it. You will lose every time. Call me lucky. I don't give a shit. You're going to lose every time. All right. So you guys uh, think about what I just said. All right. Take care of yourselves. Patreon.com slash Rio Macro. Take care. Bye-bye.